Kept you waiting, huh? <laughs> What's happening, everyone? Uh, Ash, Lurk work is over. Gotta hang out with the kiddo. Have a good rest of your stream. Thank you for the lurk, uh, Ash. Have fun as well. Have fun with kiddo. Have fun with kiddo. And uh, thank you for the lurk. Uh, oh, oh, we're good. We're good. Never mind. Right. No disaster. No dis disaster. No nothing bad happened there. That's fine. Right. Okay. 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 Now I've been thinking about things on my break. All right. Nick, have you got any forty fives by any chance? Nick. Hey. I'm. Li he don't. Okay. That's fine. No, it's unfortunate that we can't save while we're here, right? Because we're actually in really good shape right now. We're actually in really, really good shape. And being as we're here, my instincts are telling me to make use of our time and go up there and get the agility bobblehead. It does involve, right, it does involve fighting through some Milux at the bottom. And when we get up onto the deck, there's a whole bunch of raiders right the way across the deck there. And then that bobblehead is right there. Look, at, you can see the raiders actually popping in and out of existence. They're not quite in render distance. My uh, scope isn't picking them up, unfortunately, because that would be quite handy. Nope. There's also a boss raider as well. There's a named raider up there. They're all, they're all really unique raiders, actually. Um... Which we'll cover if I decide to go up there. The thing that scares me from doing that, though, is I can't save right now. But, oh, sod it. We're going to do it, aren't we? We're going to go and attempt to always be sneaking. Always be sneaking. Right, I'm going to go over to Kellogg's. I find this gun is pretty damn useful against uh, my lurks. I'm not sure how we're looking for crit. Hang on. Oh, we got full crit as well. Nice. I want to try and keep that until the deck if we can. Wreck of the FMS Northern Star. There's some There's some there. They're already going to be damaged as well because uh, there is... Uh, I think they fight against some... Oh, they're fighting the Raiders. That's odd. There's a hole in the floor in the deck. And they've aggroed each other because obviously they wouldn't be... Uh, they wouldn't be homies with raiders. That's going to work in our benefit, perhaps. We'll just wait wait until one of them wins. It's going to be the raiders as well. The Milux can't do anything. Well, the hunters have got a spit attack. But I doubt they're going to be uh, able to do much with it, with it. So the raiders are definitely going to win this encounter. Oh god, it's coming right for me. It's coming right for me. It's a razor claw as well. I'll take the 50-50s to the face. Oh, that would have been a sneak attack. It's okay. We took it out in one shot anyway. I'm in danger. Fantastic. Okay. What's got me in danger? The thing is, I don't want to move too far back away. Because it could be the raiders. It could be the raiders. And if I move away, they're going to shoot me from up on top deck. I think, I'm, I think they're both going to be aware of my presence, to be fair. Bit of luck, though. They'll finish off this hunter. I'm in caution. Fantastic. We're in caution. Hidden. Brilliant. Okay, because I don't want to get shot at from above. I want to keep hidden. Nice. Okay. Oh. I'm going to have to do this in the dark as well. So I don't want to draw their attention. I hope this isn't radioactive water either. There's definitely going to be more Milux as well. 100%. It's, it's radio. It's very radioactive. Very radioactive. Why am I? Okay, we're popping a radex, and I'm parched from that. That's actually beneficial. And I'm gonna have to find my way up in the dark, which isn't ideal. Goop. Uh, there's a hole in the floor in the deck, in the log, in the bottom of the sea. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen that happen. I've never seen them fight each other through that um through the the floors. It's interesting. It's very interesting. Oh, oh Nick, you fucking you spooked me. God damn it. 
Nothing but a liability, are you, Nick? Nothing but a liability. Right, am I going the right way here? It's potentially going to be uh, gun turrets as well. Right, I'm going to have to go in the water. Shit. Okay, this might not be the correct way. Fuck. Okay. Let's get out of here. Ah! What's this? Aha. Oh. Okay. How the fuck do I get up there? I can't remember. Aha! Sneaky. Okay. Careful of gun turrets. These uh, these raiders are very prepared. Okay, they're very very prepared. In fact, I'm gonna go over to Old Faithful for a bit. We've got some oh more rads and some uh, more Mylurks as well, but they're dead because the raiders have already taken them out. Right. I'm going to use this very, very specifically to take out searchlights as well. Because it's quiet and I've got a lot of ammo. Right, there's one. Oh. Okay. I've seen it. This is going to get me in caution, I think. Yeah. Straight over to caution. Give me your meat, good sir. Ooh, viable blood sample as well. Uh, I'll take your bits. Right, okay. I'm getting back off immediately. Okay, so far so good. There's going to be more turrets though. And more spotlights. Oh, hello, sir. Raider veteran. He's already been damaged, so I'm going over to Kellogg's. More beneficial, right. Might get lucky with a headshot. Rest in the body. That should finish him off. Missed. Oh, God. He moved. He moved. He moved so fucking quickly. I'm only in caution, though. Go on, Nick. I'll flank him. Ready? Fuck you. I missed. Brilliant. Fuck you. What a waste of, wo what a waste of ammo. This ammo is hard to come by. I'm in danger. I'm in danger. I take out you first. Oh, I'm also off work. Yay. Yay. Friday's begun then. Oh, shit. Hello. Okay, you're just a raider waster. Uh, I shouldn't be using this gun. Right, back off. Back off. Change weapon. Right. I'm going to get the crit on him just to get my action points back. Oh, I don't need to. I don't need to. Bit of luck. Oh, we got the headshot. Fantastic. Uh, uh, the weekend started for you now, Goop. Hooray. Happy Big Friday. Heavy metal leg. Oh, 45s. This guy had 45s. Right, back over to Old Faithful. Did I reload? Not sure I reloaded. I did. It's fine. Let's try and get... Ah, I got eyes on another... That's not a spotlight. But I do have eyes on another gun turret. You can take that out. And there's a raider. Ooh, there's a few down there. Uh, guys, hold on to that. Present for you. Okay, we got at least someone. You're at full health. Uh, go for the head and then the body. Take a chance. Nice. Double damage on a headshot there. Because he was at full health. Buddy, what are you going on? You know 45s? Ooh, another Mylurk. Scared the crap out. Hello. Did a bird just come out of the sky and push that corpse? Is that what just happened? Right, you look like a melee guy. Alright, we'll try and get a headshot on you. I've got plenty of AP. It's fine. Cool. Getting lucky with my shots. I'm in danger. Where's he gonna come from? 
I think a bird just like pushed that physics. Oh, the, he's the he's the unique. Right, go for the head. One, two, three, four, five. Right, put the fifth one in the head as well. But we should be finishing before the fifth shot on our crit. But just to make sure. One. Oh, there we go. He's dead. Two. Nice. Um. <clears throat> Unfortunately, we didn't hear him say much dialogue. That guy just said something. I think I might have forgotten to put general subtitles on, though. Ooh, a, ooh, a magazine. Permanently gain better prices when buying from a vendor. Fantastic. Um, these guys, they speak in, like... Oh, I forget what it is. I think it's, like, either Swedish or Scandinavian or something. They all have unique uh, lines. And they're all ghouls as well. They're a, a gang of uh, raider ghouls. Um, who speak in, uh, I think it's like Scandinavian. Don't quote me on that, though, and I'm really sorry if I'm wrong. I can't run. Oh, shit, right. Do you know what? Just eat some grilled red stag. It'll be fine. I've only got... Okay, I don't have a lot of it. Worst case scenario, though, we hand some stuff off to Nick. Um, I think we're clear as well. Oh, no, 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 wait, wait. We're not gonna be clear. There's a mattress in that, uh... In that place. Oh, even better, a bed. I think Rags has a, a living room of his own, though. He should have a bed that we can use back here. So we'll use it once we picked up all the valuables. Oh, I'm so happy that worked out. We could cook here as well. That's nice. Oh, I got a bunch of my luck meat. I'm going to do that. I'm actually going to do that. Cook a bunch of stuff. Uh, oh, there we go. Roasted my left meat. Oh, we can make a ton of that. Cool. Alright. Good stuff. I'm so glad that that worked out really, really well. Because now we've got something amazing. We have the agility bobblehead. Hell yeah. And with that, I've been sitting on a bunch of level ups, right? For this uh, exact purpose. Action Girl is now available to us because we just boosted our agility with that uh, bobblehead. I'm going to boost it one. Okay. Now, uh... Shit. I didn't mean to boost it one. I was meant to take the perk. It doesn't matter. We'll just put points into the, the rest of the points into the perk. My bad. Uh, it was already active because of the bobblehead. I miscalculated. But that's fine. Uh, more agility never hurts. And now we've got 50% uh, re uh, regen on our action points. Which is going to be amazing for us. If I didn't just mess up and spend a point incorrectly. Um, we could have had that at 75%. But it's fine. It's fine. Um, you can never have enough agility. It's absolutely fine. But I made a, I made a bit of a mistake there. Right, uh, let's drop a save before we go anywhere as well, because we just got the ability, the agility bobblehead. Whew, I'm tired. Okay, being as I'm tired, let's have a full sleep then. I'll get seven hours in. It's probably an hour too many, actually. Never mind. Help defend Abenanti Farm. Fuck, I like Abenanti Farm. I'm going to have to go and help them, aren't I? Wow, it's really foggy today. Okay. Uh, hopefully, hopefully I can make it back to the Atom Cats uh, in time to use a Vertibird Grenade and get to Abernanthe and help them out. Oh, that's Warwick. That's towards Warwick. It's fucking fog is actually throwing me off. It's throwing me off big time. Right, just follow this road and we should end up at um, the Atom Cats. Shit. We're going to get attacked if we go there. We should still have the time though. We should still have time to go and help Abernanthe as well. Hold on. Hmm. 
No, I've changed my mind. We're going straight to Abenanthi Farm, okay? Reason being, I actually want to spend some time with the Atom Cats and show them off properly. So, um, I, I can't do that if I'm, like, worried about Abenanthi. So let's go straight to Abenanthi. Put my frags back on before I forget as well. Did that work? I hope they can land here. There's a lot of trees here. I don't think that worked. I didn't see the notification come up in the corner. Oh, can I hear something? I can't see anything. It's foggy as shit. I hear a vertebrate. Right, it worked. It worked. We didn't waste the grenade. Is something shooting? I can hear gunfire. Alright, get in. Just get in and get out of here. Something's firing at it, I think. Right, hurry up, get out of here. I hear gunfire. Nick's off to Nick's off to fight whatever it is. It's fine. Um Abenanthi. Man, this is miles away as well. I like Abenanthi though, I wanna help them out. Nick, it's probably best you go on foot. The Brotherhood don't like synths. They w they might not understand. Oh, shit. I think I'm getting shot by raiders. Yeah, I'm getting shot by raiders on Poseidon Energy. That's fine. It's not, it's not great weather, though, is it? The weather's not really great. Not for flying. Are you doubling back? Buddy, we're getting shot at. Let me, let me help you out. Oh, never mind. Fuck you, Raiders! I don't think Nick got in. <laughs> I think Nick ran away. Hold on, let's see if we can see him inside. Oh, he's inside! He made it! Well done, Nick. Good job. I don't like to shoot down on anything when I'm uh, in a vertebrate, though. Especially not things like rad scorpions or milex. They have a tendency, especially rad scorpions. Rad scorpions will just burrow underground, and then they'll teleport to you when they when they la when you land. So try not to shoot anything. You could end up aggroing them, and they could follow you <laughs> right across the Commonwealth. So be careful. Be careful what you shoot at. Most things are okay, like super mutants and and things like that. People who are like um, have dedicated zones where they they belong, but if you come across a, like a random rad scorpion or something of that nature, more often than not they'll burrow underground and teleport right to you when you land. Oh, hello, vertebrate friend. Hello. I wonder where they're off to. Ha! Ah, I'm getting shot. Who's shooting at me? Which one of y'all shot me? What's that there? Is that Diamond City? I think that's Diamond City. Diamond City, when you pass over Diamond City in a uh, vertebrate, it's very low res. It's very low res. I'm assuming that's what it looks like before you head into the load zone. And it loads everything in in detail. It's really funny though when you fly over Diamond City. It's all a bit wobbly, though, when you're in a vertebrate, if I'm honest with you. Flying through buildings and popping and all sorts of nonsense. I hope it's not something like... Oh, imagine if it's Rust Devils. Can you imagine if Rust Devils are fighting Abenanthi? That's not going to be... That's not going to be good. It's horrible if Rust Devils or something really powerful comes to your settlement, actually. Because, um, I think, uh, what I said about Rad Scorpions, I think that would work with, uh, Mole Rats as well. Because they burrow as well. Uh, but, yeah, it's really horrible when nasty stuff attacks your settlements. Because I can't use my best gun. Legendary enemy is mutated. 
What do you mean? Who the fuck's shooting at me now? What legendary enemy? <laughs> that's, uh, that's concerning. That's very concerning. What caused the legendary uh, enemy to mutate? I didn't attack it. Something shot at me as well. I bet it has something to do with Nick. I bet Nick had something to do with it. We can see Sunshine Tidings from here as well. It's not quite loaded in. But that's it, over there. It's across the dam that we always cross to get there. Oh, here we are, Abenanti. Oh, it's Rust Devils. It's Rust Devils. Oh, shit, that's an Assaultron. No, it's not. It's fine. It's just a junk bar. Like right, I don't have a good shot at anything, unfortunately. Right, let's go. It's definitely... It's 100% Rust Devils. That's not good. Right. Come on, take you out. You're a full health. Let's go. Okay. Provisioners over there. That's our guy. That's fine. Lucy. Uh, can you aim at the baddies, please? Game. Right, I can take you out. Right. Fair play. She's using a baseball bat. Uh, another thing about robots. You want to shoot them in the body. The body's basically their headshot. That'll do more damage than the head will. We good. Still in caution. Oh, there we go. We've uh, we've helped defend them, but apparently I'm still in caution. Forty-fives. Nice. A robot's a good source of forty-five ammo. Wonder. Right, Nick's Nick Nick's got a new gun. I don't know where he picked that up from. He's got an assault rifle. Oh, hello. Oh, you're just a provisioner. That's fine. What's got me in caution? And what's got Nick so uh, riled up? Fusion cells. I'll take the torso as well. Oh, that looks like... That looks like... That's blue lasers. That must be synths. Synths v. Brotherhood, I'm, I'm guessing. Yeah, there's definitely synths down there. See if I can get him from here. Nice. Still in caution. Vats isn't picking. Oh, the rag stag. The rag stag has gone hostile. Let's take you out. I missed. I missed again. Flipping heck. That was like a 70 odd percent chance, right? There we go. Still in caution. Right, everyone's pointing their guns down there. There must be more synth activity, I'd imagine. Okay. Let's move in slowly. If I could find that corpse as well, I could pick up his ammo. Oh, hello. Oh, it's just a bloke fly. Why is everyone flipping out over a bloat fly that's miles away? That was an amazing shot, even if I do say so myself. There's quite a few of them. I'll take the 50 50. Missed. Missed. Another 50 50. Okay. Get him, Nick. These things are a pain in the ass to hit. Ooh. Go for the 50-50. Missed. Dang it. Oh, hello. Uh, what? What just happened? He kind of like came out to shoot him and missed. All right. Right, are we done? Still in caution. What's coming in caution? Right, let's back up. Let's go back to Abernanti. It did complete the quest, so they're safe at least. I don't know why we're still in caution. Nick's pointing over there. 
More blue flies, more bugs, more synths. I'll be doing the world a service. What the flip? My vats isn't picking anything up. Give me that bug meat. Nom 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 nom. Oh! Oh, ghouls. Right, okay. Let's not bother with them. I think I know where they're coming from. I don't know what... I don't know why I'm still in caution for and why Nick's so wound up. <coughs> It'll be fine, though. Let's head back to Abernanthe. Can't believe it was Rust Devils, but it turned out to be fairly easy anyway. Which is good. You're a super mutant. Why have you got? Why is there a super mutant here? Did they get attacked by super mutants as well? Very strange. You, fusion cells. Give me those. Oh, I'll take that extra torso as well. Give me that. Right. I get, while I'm here as well, this is um, Abernathy's part of our network, so we can dump a whole bunch of stuff here to clear some weight. Right, uh, first of all, let's put all these mods away. They're robot mods as well. Uh, put all of this junk away as well. And surely I've got some aid that we can put away. Uh, I'm going to cook whatever. What was that? Okay, nobody's freaked out anymore, so I guess the danger's gone. Is that Abernathy? Uh, is that, um, what's his name? Blake? Hey, Blake. Mr. Abernathy. Thanks for your help. <coughs> no problem, dude. Glad to help. I was glad to help. Out. I like I these guys. These guys are cool. Who knows what would have happened to us if you hadn't been here? You probably would have been fine, I'd imagine. You would have been alright. You need to give yourself more credit, Ab uh, Blake. You really should. Right. Uh, put that away. Put that away. Did we go through... Oh, I was going to cook, right? I forget what the cooking station is in this place. I think it's round... Yeah, there it is. Oh, no, 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 wait. Wait, wait, wait. Never mind. It's going to include everything that I've got in storage. So, don't cook here. So, I've got loads of stuff stored away. Um, in that case then, just put away all the meat. Uh, buff out can go. Jet can go. Mute fruit can go. Right away. Whiskey. Put the whiskey away. Jobs are good. Then. Problem is now... Oh, hello. Oh, I forgot you live here. Yeah, we took uh, Zamonja for the railroad, right? But Caretaker ended up staying here. And we actually have a, a quest to turn into you. So, hey, buddy. Already taken care of. I hardly even <laughs> Sue broke Ellen. sweat. Freaking hobos. Not the whiskey. Sue Ellen, what's up? Katie, Sue Ellen. How are you? Take this. How are you? Long time. Right, it's been a while later. since we spoke. I hope Thanks, you're doing bro. well. Happy Big Friday. Thanks for coming along as well, Sue Ellen. Happy Big Friday, not the whiskey. At least it's not gin, right? Am I right? Uh, have you got anything else Caretaker. for me, buddy? I don't know how much more I got of this. What do you mean? Caretaker. What was that? Oh, nothing. <laughs> he's really jumpy, which Caretaker. is funny. Yeah, yeah. Hi, and whatever. All right, he's got no more uh, jobs for us either. Right, the problem that we've got now is now we're miles away from where we need to be, right? We're all the way up here in Sanctuary. What I'm going to do, um, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to fly home, I think. Actually, should we fly home or should we walk it? Walking it shouldn't be too much trouble, right? I know it takes longer, but it'll also save a vertebrate grenade, which I've just used one to get here. And I'm probably going to need to use another one to get to Jamaica Plain again. Yeah, let's walk it. Let's walk it. Because I've got, what, I think I've got six more in my uh, in my inventory. Whoops, wrong button. Yeah, we'll walk home. 
And then I'm gonna I'm gonna think about maybe making a robot when we get home. Make a robot so that I can link Jamaica Plain to um, Hangman's Alley. And then we'll uh, get all of our stuff in storage linked to uh, Jamaica Plain then. So we can uh, make that into a nice home and operate from there. Because uh, that's where we need to go back to. Honestly, I didn't plan on coming up this neck of the Commonwealth. But uh, I do like Abernanthy, so I was going to stick up for them and help them out. I did, should not be running around either. I should not be running down here. There's a, always a chance that an event spawned here. So uh, that was uh, that was careless of me. I can sleep here as well. So we can drop a save down, which is nice. Um, how many people have we got in our people farm now? Let's have a look. Eleven. Any of you unassigned? Oops, that's not what I wanted. Uh, where's my bell? There's my bell. Is that a ring? Uh, so Ellen, yes, we do the preparation for Wacken now. What? Seriously? So we're kind of busy purchasing beer. That's awesome. That's awesome. It's good to see you, though. It's good to see you. I'm glad you've been doing well. Right, all of you are assigned to food. You're not assigned. Right, buddy. You know exactly what I'm going to do, don't you? Um, all this food is... Ah. Buddy, work on the carrots. This one carrot. Work on this one carrot right by here. There we go. Job's good. Un. Anyone else? Dang, a lot of you are unassigned. We could use one of you to hook up um, Jamaica Plain to uh, Hangman's Alley. Being as there's so many of you. But... Um, do you know what I'm going to... Mm. Yeah, I'm going to wait, okay? Because I'm going to try and uh, make my first robot. And use a robot for that task instead. You, it's always good to have excess uh, settlers anyway. You know? Just in case. Just in case we need them for a task later on. Right. Wow, it's been a, it's been a long while since we made this trip, right? We haven't made this trip in a, probably since we've uh, obtained the ability to uh, fly around. But uh, it's, ni it's nice to be uh, on the open road again. Walking through all of my settlements, you know, it is nice. Okay. Just past here, then we're more or less at Grey Garden. Cross the bridge, then we're at Oberland. And then just a bit further down the road, and we're in our we're in our lovely neighbourhood. I'm never talking smack about our neighbourhood ever again. Not since going down south to Quincy. We live we live in a posh area compared to uh, Quincy. We live in a really lovely area with neighbourhood watch and everything compared to Quincy. We had a big uh, mob of. Uh, Remember when there was that big, uh, like, I don't know what you would call a deer in a pack. A pack? A pack of deer. When there was a bunch, a whole bunch of red stags up there that one time. One being legendary. That was a long time ago. We couldn't even, we were getting killed by uh, red stags back then. There goes the neighborhood. Absolutely. Absolutely, Sue Allen. I'm never talking bad about our neighborhood again. I'd rather live where we live. Than live in bloody Quincy. Quincy's a nightmare. Oh my god. Since when was Grey Garden under attack? That's super mutants as well. I didn't get a warning for that, right? Game, why didn't you tell me about that? No. Apparently it's still not noteworthy enough either. It's just a bunch of super mutants here. It's okay. Grey Garden's full of uh, Mr. Handies. So they're actually quite tough. And these are just regular super mutants as well, by the looks of things. They're just a regular variant, so all of my attacks should actually one-shot them. Right. We've got a Mr. Handy in the way there. So I'm not going to take the risk of hitting him. Oh, of course I missed. 
Oh, he's going. Oh, he's going inside. Oh, we got him. We got him. Right. Clear shot on him. I'll take the 50-50. It doesn't even matter that he's not at full health either. These are just basic super mutants. My um, my Mr. Handys could probably deal with these without my health. That's probably why it didn't notify me. Maybe. Maybe that's the case. Kind of glad I was passing by now, though, because I really like this uh, settlement as well. I'll take their money. Hell yeah. Ooh, mole rat meat I'll take. Excellent. Okay. Let's keep on keeping on. I don't think there's any need to save. I'm going to regret saying that, though. I'm going to regret not saving. Well, you know, Oberlin's just up ahead. We can save there. Do you know what else as well? I could have swore that um, the endurance bobblehead was at the Atom Cat's place. But that was the unarmed bobblehead, which is completely useless to us. So I'm not entire. I can't remember off the top of my head where the endurance bobblehead is. And we really need that. It's really, really, really important. It's really, really important. I want maybe Poseidon energy. Maybe I don't know. I'm getting like vague memory of it being there, but I also might be like guessing. I'm, I can't remember. It's, it's, yeah, I think it's Poseidon energy. Right, drop a save just in case. I'm ill. Brilliant. Lethargy. What's the? Is that more sleep? Uh, wrong button. AP refresh minus 50 after we just got action girl action girls kind of compensating for it I wonder though I wonder if uh, it works like that it just take it just deducts the straight 50 that I get from action girl and probably not right it probably works on it like um, a percentage of that including the extra 50 percent if that makes sense so that could be potentially be really bad potentially. Um, I'm gonna, uh, I'm not gonna use antibiotics, though. I'm gonna go and get it healed, uh, by a doctor. We need a doctor at home. We really need a doctor at home. It's only gonna, like, oh, God. I wasn't paying attention. There's always trouble here. Always. But, yeah, we need a doctor at home. 100%. It's only going to save us a trip up to Diamond City, but still, it'll be uh, more convenient, you know? Plus, it'll make our base even better. Oh, I hear... <gasps> Rust Devils. Right, fuck you. Okay. We're in caution. The rest... I don't want to jinx it. But I was going to say, the Rust Devils haven't been too bad, right? The ones that we've come across. Who are you? She's dead now. Because I can't vat her. Maybe she's... Yeah, she's dead. She got killed by that Mr. Uh, Mr. Handy. Oh, hello. Right, you're, uh, you're hostile. Take you out. Shotgun, no good. Clear, right? There's no danger around. Take their money, at the very least. Biometric scanner, I'll take that. Okay. Right, I think we're clear. We can run home now. I really need to get rid of this illness, though. I'm going to pick up uh, one extra antibiotics while I'm here, actually. So we, had, we were carrying round two, but we ended up using one, right? Am I right? Hang on. No, we got killed, right? And we didn't need to... Uh... Oh, no. We, it did, uh... we did use one. Uh... Oh, we could get a free rad sc scrub while we're here. Sweet. Give me that. Oh, amazing. Hey, everyone. I feel like it's been a long time since I've seen everyone. What's Ada doing in there? Weird. I feel like it's been an awfully long time since I've seen all my gang. 
it's nice to see you all. Right, I'm pretty sure we just dealt with all, all of our uh, inventory, so no need to do that. Um, flip. It's really awkward to get to my chest. Um, what did I want to put away? Hollow tags. Right. Let's, uh, let's, I'm going to sleep thirsty. You should never do that. But, uh, we'll sleep for 10 hours should be fine. That should be a, uh, that should land on a time where the doctor's open. Peckish from lack of food. Right. Before we go to Diamond City, though, let's make the most of our time. Um, mute hand chops. Oh, no, 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 no. Mutt chops. My bad. Here we go. Let's uh, have a go at making a robot. Then I want to use this robot to link um, Jamaica Plain up to here. New automatron. Hopefully we've got enough bits to make a pretty good one. Right, legs. Let's put on... Hmm. Keep protector on legs for a second. Let's see what kind of weaponry we can give this thing. Uh, Tectron hand claw. We want something good, right? Ooh. I got some good options from uh, science. We could give it two automatic hand lasers. That would be pretty cool. Or full on lasers. What does that do? 34 damage in energy weapons. Whereas the hand lasers do 31. So the gun's going to be better. Right? What I'm going to do. Um, I might give him a hand laser. And a regular laser. No, let's give him two, right? Let's give him two. One on the left. I should be able to make... Oh, I can make two of these at most. I'm really low on fiber optics. Okay, what kind of materials does the hand laser take? About the same. In terms of fiber optics. Everything else isn't a worry. In that case, I may as well make the more powerful ones, right? Tell you what, let's give him one laser, left hand laser for now. No, not the left hand laser, sorry. The automatic laser. Because he needs a weapon, so let's do that. But then we need to uh, see what we got in terms of uh, armor. Oh, that doesn't take any uh, fiber optics. Okay, cool. Let's armor him up first. That'll do. Factory armor. Well, we could give him more armor if we give him a hand laser. What's the damage on that? 62? That's even better! Right, give him that. And then some hand armor. For some extra protection. Legs, I'm going to keep him with a protector on legs. Storage armor is going to be perfect. He's got a little bag on his butt. He is going to be shifting around uh, stuff between settlements. So that actually works. Give him some leg armor as well. Improve his survivability. He's going to be going past some rough neighborhoods, this guy. You know? Keep the same torso. Storage armor? Hell yeah. Rear torso armor? Yep. Ooh, we can put a mod in him. Um, uh, they're not really useful. Uh, they're not really useful. Adds hacking subroutine. Adds pick up. Some of the ones that we would be... Oh, that's tied to robotics expert. Like, if I had, say, for instance, 
a resistance field. That would be useful, because if I ever bump into him on my travels, and then I get into trouble, and he's nearby, he's going to increase my damage resistance. Same if he's by a settlement that gets attacked. So, uh, when we're able to pick that up, I just need Robotics Expert 1. We'll give him something like that. That'll, improve, that'll benefit me as well as him. Well, actually, it'll benefit mainly me. What heads can we give him? It'll be funny to give him a, a Saltron head. Or a sentry head, that'd be even funnier. Plus he has a light when... Uh... Yeah, let's give him that. That's going to be amazing. And then we'll armor it up with some factory armor. What we can also do with this guy as well... Uh, hold on, let me look at his left arm again. Do we miss out on any armor? No, everything's fine. Okay, we can actually give him a, a voice and personality. Um, I'm going to give him... Oh, sentry voice. That'd be funny. He's a little protectron with sentry head. It'd be funny if he spoke like a sentry. I, f I feel like giving him beeps. Or beep click. Ooh, he's giving him a bleep dark voice. I'm going to keep it like it is. I'm going to keep it like it is. We can also give him a paint job as well. Um, he's going to be going to from Jamaica Plains. Uh, let's give him... What are we saying, guys? What color do we want to make him? Um, good. Well, you might have enough bits, but do you have enough bobs? <laughs> 100%. We just built our first robot. I'm going to make him olive green. I think he'll uh, blend in. There's a, lot of, uh, there's a lot of gunners down that way as well, right? Let's go olive green. Plus, the olives are delicious. And then finally, we can name him. What should we call him, guys? Our first ever... No, pink! Pink? Alright, I'll change it to pink. I'll change it to pink. Olive... <laughs> oh, done. That's amazing. Olive... Oh, I'm using my keyboard. I'm using my keyboard, not realizing that I'm on Xbox. What a dumbass. Do you ever do that? Do you ever go to the... When you're playing, like, your... Um, console through your PC. Do you ever go to type things in with your uh, your keyboard, thinking that that's how you do it? When you're like, no shit, I'm using, I'm I'm on my console. What am I doing? Anyway, right. This is our first ever robot. Say hi to Oliver. He's got a shiny face, which is great because that's good. Oliver, you're right there. You're right there, mate. Can you figure out? What you need to do? He's got a laser laser hand and a laser gun hand. And it's an automatic laser gun hand. Right, while you're struggling to leave... Where'd he go? Oliver! Wait. What? We've only just met, buddy. Where'd you go? Homie. Oh, there he is. He's ended up over here for some reason. It is rather crowded in this settlement, so there's probably no room for him to do his thing. Right, buddy. I'm going to move you, okay? You're going to Jamaica Plain. Set Jamaica Plain as new home? Absolutely. But before you go, right, um, you need to link to here. Assign supply line to Hangman's Alley. 100%. There we go. Right. Now, if we look at the map, Excellent. Jamaica Plain is hooked in. It's hooked into the network. So now, when we go back to Jamaica Plain, because that's still going to be our point of reference down uh, the south, around Quincy area, uh, we'll be able to share all our resources now. So we'll be able to uh, defend it, build a water source, and that's going to be our little uh, home for the time being, where we're going to go back and forth uh, dealing with the loader. What is with the fog today? I could have cleared this up. I could have fired a firework and cleared this up. Never mind. There's Cricket. Cricket gets around, don't she? We saw her not so long ago and bought a bunch of ammo off her down in Ho uh, Warwick Homestead. Now she's all the way back up here. She, fair play. She gets around. Right. All I'm going to be doing now uh, is getting uh, is seeing a doctor to get rid of my illness. And then we're going to get another yeah, vertebrate. We'll save again. We'll save back a Hangman's Alley. Sure and then uh, I'm going to catch a vertebrate back down to Jamaica Plain. <laughs> I 
<laughs> no, me smart. Oliver is not the brightest candle on the cake. I love Oliver. He's special. I love Oliver as well. We really, we really made, uh, we really made a great robot there. He's fantastic. Right, the doctor's hundred percent should be open. If he's not open right now, he's a lazy. Right, he's open. He's lucky. <laughs> Oliver's amazing. What I normally do. Uh, with supply lines, Let's it's fine in this right instance. Away. It's more I fun if you guys get to uh, get to name them. But uh, kill me, kill my yeah. lethargy. Take a look at me, uh, what I and normally do, symptoms. just to keep track of things, it's a lot easier. It's practical more than anything. I love giving my robots unique names, Got but what I uh, usually do for practicality side. purposes, oh. I name them after the settlement. Yeah. That way, then I know where they insane. belong right. and where they're coming from. Let's get started. It's a lot easier to track all of your supply lines. So yeah. in that instance, Any Oliver would complaints? be called Jamaica Plain, but uh, Oliver's more fun. Oliver's much no more fun. Complaints. Take better care of yourself. Right. All right, Doctor. Jeez. Right. That's uh, lethargy gone without using any antibiotics as well. We saved uh, on uh, one antibiotic. Right, okay. Uh, back to Hangman's Alley. I'm gonna, uh, I think I've still, I've probably got some mods on me that I forgot to dump. Um, and then uh, also pick up one more antibiotics for the road, just in case. And we'll get a bit, a bit back down to Jamaica Plain. One thing I gotta do uh, pretty quickly down in Jamaica Plain as well is build uh, one of those stops for the Roman traders. Uh, it's very, uh, we're relying on luck a lot, but we could get really lucky and get, uh, say, Doc Weathers visitors or something in, in a pinch. He might uh, sell antibiotics as well, you never know. But at the very least, he'll be able to cure any illness that we might pick up. So uh, that's quite important. And then a water source as well. A water source is really important as well. We could probably fortify the place a bit better as well, if I'm honest. The good thing about um, setting up supply lines as well is that they will patrol. They're, they will legitimately go back and forth um, your settlements. And that is a pathway then where um, you've got some extra extra help and extra backup. Hello, Trash Can Carla. Hey, Carla. Back again? I haven't seen you for a Time while. To do business? Yeah, let's see what you got. Why not? I'll take a look. Sure. Yeah, yeah. Keep your shirt on. Keep my shirt on? You sell 45s and 44s. And fusion cells. I'm gonna buy her out. I'm just gonna do it. It's gonna cost a bit, but it'll be worth it. 418 caps. That's not a lot. It's not a lot at all. What have you got um, in terms of um, junk and resources? What um, do you have any uh, shipments? Concrete. We could get some concrete. No, I'm happy with the ammo. Thank you very much. Pleasure doing business with you as always, Carla. I'm uh, carrying too much, apparently. My legs are going to snap. I've got too much ammo on me. I've got way too much ammo on me. Uh, these weigh, though, so let's get rid of them. I'm one over. Um, shit. Mole rat meat, that can go. Mutant hound meat, that can go. Right, we're one under at the moment. How am I so heavy? It's all the ammo. It's definitely all the ammo. Right, okay. Aid. Um, oh, I know what else we can dump while we're here. Medex. One of them can go away. Four of these can go away. Oh, five then. Never mind. Finger slipped. Ah, we got a whole bunch of stuff. Got a whole bunch of unique stuff that we picked up. Before I forget as well, let's um, improve our armor. Oh my god. I might need to rearrange my room. <laughs> At some point. <laughs> it's really awkward to get to my chest. <laughs> there we go. Right. Because um, I got a bunch of uh, unique stuff. So, uh, let's pop away... 
This is our old armor. Let's put that away. And put Tass's fist away. I've got to remember that's there. Because I might incorporate that in our final um, power armor build. Uh, I've got something to go in the general chest as well. Dog meat. Do you mind getting out of the way a sec, boy? What? No, I wanted to... There we go. Right. Um... DC guard helm, that can go away. Where have I got weaponry wise? Do I really need to take a plasma mine with me? Probably not. I've got a whole bunch of explosives actually. Much better for carry weight now as well. Even with the uh, surplus ammo that we just picked up. Right, I want to take a look at my uh, armor. It's already better and we haven't even uh, bothered with it yet. Right, lucky set synth chest piece. What are we going to be able to boost this up? Oh my god, 37 ballistic and 41 energy. That's amazing. That was such a lucky drop. No pun intended. That is such a lucky drop. I'm going to go for... Do we go for deep pocketed for the extra carry weight? Or what we could do is we could go for dense. Greatly reduces damage from explosions. That's going to be useful. With the amount of times that we've been getting blown up lately... That could that could be a life changer. Yeah, I'm gonna go for dense rather than our usual uh, deep pocketed. That could end up actually saving our lives at some point. That armor that we've just uh, equipped, well, we've had equipped for a while now, but that armor that we've just upgraded, that's gonna make a world of difference. That's really improved our survivability there. Amazing. Okay, one quick save, and then uh, we're going to catch uh, a ride back to Jamaica Plain. Uh, before I do that, let me have a drink. There, I name my shit like a random food most of the time. I have a cat named Schnitzel. <laughs> what a great name for a cat. That's really funny. Schnitzel the cat. Uh, the moment when the town hobo says, you should keep your shirt on. <laughs> True. Um, right. We don't even need to sleep. We just need to uh, drop the autosave. And then uh, we'll be on our way. It was, it was great seeing you all again, guys. It really was. But uh, I gotta go uh, hang out somewhere else now for the time being. Right. Shouldn't be any trouble up here. I don't think uh, we've rested long enough for there to be trouble. We should be clear. Uh, where are my vertebrate grenades? I'm going to have to top up, like, make sure that I don't get caught out with these grenades. I need at least one left to travel back to the Pridwin and buy more. Just bear that in mind. Otherwise, we're going to have to walk to the Pridwin, Pridwin to uh, restore them. Who was that? Uh, just a random. <laughs> was that Ir idiot or it? I can't really. Oh, idiot! It was idiot. I couldn't read it properly. Thank you so much for the follow. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Just a, a random. Uh... No, should I call you random? I don't want to call you uh, the last part of that name. I feel I feel mean if I called you that. Is random okay? Thank you very much for the follow, though. That's great. Thank you. I really appreciate that. Right. Okay. Let's get out of here. Back to Jamaica Plain. <laughs> Any. This is fine. Anything. Okay. Thank you for the follow again. And uh, happy Big Friday. I'm going to get you some uh, apples in the chat for two reasons. Being a first time chatter today. And also for the follow as well. You deserve those apples. They're good apples as well. Good apples for uh, random. Right, okay. Jamaica Plain. Back to where we started today. <laughs> but it's not been a no progress stream. Okay, we've made progress. We've made some quite good progress, actually. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for the redeem. Good shooting, ma'am. We may be back where we started, but we've made progress. 
some really good progress at that as well. I really wish I didn't fuck up with my um, uh, allocation on my uh, agility. It doesn't really matter because um, agility is a good. Uh, it's got some good perks in that tree, so it's w worth boosting it anyway. And we probably will would have ended up boosting it a little uh, in the future anyway. But we could have had uh, maxed out action girl if I didn't uh, mess up. Never mind. The worst thing about that as well, there was a bed right next to us. I could have saved first, but I was uh, I was too hasty. I was too hasty. Let that be a lesson to you if you're playing this game. Do not be too hasty. Think everything through before you take the plunge. Especially on this mode, when you can only save when you uh, when you sleep. But uh, lesson learned, I guess. Lesson learned. Again, I'm not shooting anything from this uh, vert bird either. Just because I don't want it to follow me home. It's the only reason why. How many um, grenades do we have left? I don't know if I changed them over either. Back to frags. I did. And we got five left. Five is plenty for the time being. Really well, Nick. We've got one left, in fact. And I know where it is. And it's really close by. It should be... Oh. Okay. No, that's fine. I know I stopped then for a second uh, because I know that there's a, a shopping trolley somewhere in the Commonwealth where if you interact with it, uh, it activates a behemoth. Uh, who said that? Thanks, random. <laughs> just uh, just a random idiot. I'm not going to be here for long. I have to make other people happy. Have a great Fully day. Erect. And, uh, you too. Thanks for the follow again. And uh, that sounds that's really lovely of you, I guess. It sounds really kind of you making other people happy. Um, so, uh, yeah, enjoy yourself. Happy Big Friday as well. I appreciate it. I really appreciate that. <laughs> that's great. Put a smile on my face. Right, okay. Let's drop a save before we do anything. All right. Everything is fine now. We are exactly where we started out, but that's fine. This comes with a power armor station. That's really handy as well. Dang it, I should have brought Tess's, um, Tess's power armor bit with me. I didn't realize there was a power armor station here. Or I forgot, one of the two. I could have stored it in our chest here. Never mind, never mind. Okay, all right, how are we doing for time, get guys? How's uh, time getting on? Hmm. Um, alright. Should we... Should we go to... Ah, oh, I've messed up. Do you know what I could have done? Saying that, I wouldn't have been able to save. But we did save back in uh, Hangman's Alley. Instead of landing here, I could have landed up here. And saved myself a trip across. It's fine. It's fine. We'll head over there. Okay. See if we can get uh, that Atom Cats uh, turned in. Because we did pick that up, this uh, this part. So uh, if we can uh, turn that in, uh, we'll be, it'll be like bringing it full circle then. If we go and turn that in, fight off the gunners. And then uh, maybe uh, maybe call it a night after that. Right, this is the place where the power armor was. The more I think about the endurance bobblehead location, the more I'm thinking it's uh, Poseidon Energy. Which is awesome, because that means that there's four really cool bobbleheads uh, in that area. We need the endurance one as well. I need the endurance one to be able to get another one. Well, three, three out of those four bobbleheads in close proximity are really good anyway. The unarmed one is um, situational. It depends on whether you're an un unarmed build or not. I personally don't really recommend an unarmed build. You may as well go for melee. Because there's not many, um, there's not many unarmed weapons in the game. Um, there was a few more added with Far Harbor. And possibly Nuka World, I can't remember. Saying that though, um, unarmed is uh, the perks in unarmed are really good, um, or they're interesting and fun uh, when it comes to making power armor. 
some of the uh, mods you can put on our uh, power armor arm pieces um, improve uh, unarmed damage. So that can be qu quite fun. But um, yeah, there's generally not that many unarmed weapons in the game. Unfortunately. It would be cool if they had like a whole bunch of different variants of, say, power fists. Like New Vegas. New Vegas really went... Uh, all out with all the different uh, power fists that they added to that game. There's quite there's a huge variety of uh, weaponry in uh, New Vegas. Come to think of it, like an insane amount for every every type and every class as well. New Vegas is great. Yeah, we do have to go around the long way, unfortunately, but. Uh, Oh, hold up. What? We're hot. Shit, okay, they've spotted me. That's fine. We need to clear these out anyway, right? Okay, this one down. Remember, there's a uh, unique named guy here. Gotta come out sooner or later. I'm in danger. I see you. Skirmisher. Oh, there's a legendary. There's quite a few coming at us now. Good thing I stocked up on ammo. I don't know where I'm getting shot from. Right, there's the legendary. From the roof, right? Shit, okay. You right, Nick? I think that legendary's got a melee weapon. I see him. Oh, it's an overlord. Okay, luckily that guy upstairs was... This guy is a legendary overlord. That's not even counting the guy who's named. I'm gonna have to... Uh, I'm gonna have to crit him in the face. Put the rest in his body and hopefully they hit. Come on. Oh, that did nothing. And that was directly to the face. He just tanked that. Right, there's his mutation. Just go down, buddy. Just go... He's taking... My god, this guy, is, this guy is tough. This is the spray and pray that he's eating. I think that's the named guy. I'm nearly dead. Dang. Dang. <laughs> okay. We need to clear out that place for two reasons, though. One for Warwick Station. Or Homestead, sorry. And two, um, because... Um, the parts that Arlen Glass has asked for. The guy, the ghoul back up in the slog, who was the guy who invented the giddy up buttercup. Um, help wanted. I think we've read plenty of them. But uh, I think that last death was a little bit of a sign. A little bit of a sign. Uh, I, think we, I think we'll end it there, right? Ooh. If I move that, the Todd rays come out. If I move that uh, microphone, my bad. I think it's a nice place to leave it. I know it's kind of a short stream for Fallout Friday. But um, I think it's a nice place to leave it. We're, we're technically where we started off. But um, we did get quite a bit done. We've been to Warwick's uh, homestead. Started uh, to get... Uh, well, started a quest for them to get them as a settlement. Uh, we've been to... Made contact with the Atom Cats. We got the Agility Bobblehead, which is the best thing that we've done today. Is get that Agility Bobblehead. And um, we went back uh, to a few of our other settlements just to help out and get some bits and bobs sorted out as well. So we have made progress. Um, I wish I didn't actually change scenes now because we could have gone, gone over what the uh, plan is. Oh, and we got the last but one tape for Nick as well. So we're nearly done with Nick. Um, we just got one more tape, which is slightly up to the north. As soon as we've got that tape, then the, that quest will wrap up literally right next door to where the uh, last tape is uh, located. So... Um, Next week, we'll go down, we'll try and clear out these super mutants, okay? So we've managed to do it. We have managed to do it, and then we got killed by Tessa. But um, we'll clear them out, get the parts, uh, go to uh, turn in the quest with the Atom Cats, then go to Warwick Station and turn in with them then as well, and get them as a settlement, hopefully. Uh, after doing that, then it's home to uh, Jamaica Plain, uh, and then uh, up to get the final tape for Nick, and finish his quest line, finally. With that out of the way, 
with uh, Nick's perk in hand, we can dismiss him temporarily because we won't be done with Nick. We may have his uh, his companion perk and finish his quest, but we won't be done with him 100%. Um, but we'll dismiss him and we'll go up to Castle and get the reward for the Minutemen faction because it's a really cool reward. It's a really, really cool reward you get with them. We've got the Brotherhood's uh, perk with... Well, I say perk. I don't mean literal perk. I mean... You know the benefit to um, side in with them which is uh, the ability to fast travel with uh, vertebrate grenades we've got the one with the railroad because we've got ballistic weave off of them which is insanely powerful I want to get the one from uh, the Minutemen next and uh, that's not far away from Jamaica Plain as well this is why I've come to Jamaica Plain to set up a shop here shop so to speak set up a, a home away from homes um, it's because we're right next to a few good locations um, if I can, if I am correct, and the uh, endurance bobblehead is in Poseidon Energy, we'll go and get that as soon as we can as well. Because with that, we can then get a point uh, extra in uh, um, endurance, and we can get the first rank of Aqua Girl, which is going to help us cross in water. Okay, it's going to make life a lot more easier traveling around this part of uh, uh, the Commonwealth as well. Because a lot of things, we're just walking around water, whereas we could have just swam across much easier. With the Endurance Bobblehead, we can deal with that, where we won't get irradiated. We won't get irradiated by water, so we can just swim straight across. And also, we can access an area with another Bobblehead that's insanely good for us. Insanely good for us, okay? It's Bobblehead City down here, right? It may be dangerous as AF. It might be, like, one of the most dangerous areas on the map. Full of gunners, full of Mylurks, full of all sorts of nasties. But it's also Bobblehead City. And three of those Bobbleheads, um, one of them we've got, but three of those Bobbleheads are really, really key uh, to our build. To our build. So uh, we'll get on with that next week, I think. Um, I we'll get on with that next week. Sorry, it's a bit of a short stream for Friday, okay? But uh, I'm not going to lie to you. Um, I do need the bathroom. I'm really, really hungry. I need to get something to eat. Um, I'll make up for it, for it tomorrow, though, okay? We'll have a good old day tomorrow. It's a uh, big Saturday tomorrow. A weekend's officially started, right? So we'll have uh, a good, long, old session tomorrow. I'm going to be back in Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker tomorrow. Um, the game got a little bit weird. I'm not going to lie. It got a little bit weird uh, last week. I'm not going to go into the gory details. But um, it's still a fantastic game, though. I'm still thoroughly enjoying it. Um, I feel as though that we've nearly finished it. Um, I don't want to go and do 100% of the game. I just want to get what we need for future releases and carry on going through the series. Because there is um, characters in this game that are going to be relevant later on. Um, but I, I think we're, we're coming close to uh, what we need to do. So uh, if you like that sort of thing, I hope to see you there. Um, Sue Ellen, I will not be there. I will be drunk most likely. <laughs> <laughs> that's fine that's fine you enjoy yourself you don't always need to be here guys it's just uh it's nice when you are though it's nice to see everyone it really is but you do you okay don't worry about me you enjoy uh your big saturday and um whatever time of day it is for you right now for me it's i've got a little bit left of my big friday okay i got about uh say an hour and a half left of my big friday but whatever you get up to today and whatever you do with your big friday uh, enjoy yourself, okay? Have fun. Be merry. Uh, but don't be daft with it, okay? Don't be daft with it. Look after yourselves as well. Okay? Enjoy yourselves, but don't be silly. Don't be silly. Don't do anything silly and don't do certainly don't do anything I wouldn't do. Okay? Uh, but uh, yeah, look after yourselves is my point. Okay? As well as having fun. Make sure uh, make sure you're s safe as well. And look after each other. We've got to look after each other these uh, these days. Um, I've got a couple of special mentions, okay? Uh, Droop Dane, thank you very much for the raid earlier on, buddy. I really appreciate that. And um, also, uh, just a random idiot. Uh, thank you very much for following as well. I really appreciate that as well. And uh, big thank you, though, to everyone who came up to hang out tonight. Um, I appreciate that more than anything. The thing that means the most to me is your time, okay? The fact that you spend a little bit of your time here with me, watching me play video games. And uh, it can be rough sometimes. The day, today was a shambles, right? At the beginning, we were making no progress for like the good, for like the first hour. Um, we were just dying and dying, but we, we got some progress in there today. So I appreciate you coming to hang out and uh, hang out with me and watch me play video games. I really appreciate that. 
Um, okay. All right. Goop, um, sorry. I'm going to just notice what you, uh, what you sent me. I'll check on, uh, I'll check on that. I'll check on that. Thanks for letting me know, though, okay? If you're still there. Sorry, I completely missed that until just a second, but I'll look into that. Thank you for letting me know. Um, while, I'm, uh, while I'm talking to you as well, Goop, I don't do this enough, okay? But I hope uh, you know I do appreciate you as well, because you guys are amazing, all right? Thank you to the mods as well. Thank you to all the mods, because uh, I don't thank you enough either. And that's um, that's that's not fair, because you guys, you guys rock. You guys rock. I need to mention you guys a bit more, okay? Uh, I don't mean a bit more. I mean, I need to mention you a lot more. It's relatively quiet on Twitch today, right? I know exactly who we're going to raid, though. 100%. 100%. There's no question. No question where we're going today. He's a very good friend of the channel. Um, you all know him and love him. And if you don't know him, uh, you soon will love him if you drop him a follow. He's, uh, he's uh, a very, very good friend of the channel. Okay. Uh, and it's uh, and he's he's streaming right now, which is awesome. Uh, Cause uh, he no, oh, he's been back for a little while now, right? But he had a long break, and it's nice to see him back. So we're gonna go and spend some time with our friend, uh, the unhappy salmon. Give him a shout out, cause uh, sometimes the raid leaves people behind. Oh, sorry, I gotta stop. This is a battle block theater cliff. Secret. <laughs> Secret. Yeah, sometimes it doesn't pull everyone over. If you do get left behind, okay. Uh, just copy paste the name and that's where we're gonna be so you can come and meet up with us uh, uh, Anyways, okay, you don't get left out left out uh, But just in case okay, because it, it, it does happen sometimes uh, It has happened in the past. Hopefully everything will be fine though, but um, right I'm gonna pull the trigger on that ready raid in just a second, but uh, before I do um, Hopefully I'll see you tomorrow. Okay 2 p.m. UK time uh, 2 p.m. UK time translates to 9 a.m. Eastern. Um, if um, uh, if uh, that helps, uh, Mecca never reads. I don't. I, I don't mind reading. I just don't really like reading out loud. Um, I don't get to do that very much. Uh, Mecca, you got to pick someone else. Why is that? Is he finished? Oh, he just did a ready raid. Oh, that's bad timing. Um, <laughs> I. If I, you guys got anyone that you'd like to suggest? Because I don't. There's not many people who I follow on right now. If you got a suggestion, that'd be cool, yo. Salmon was a surefire choice. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure that's not true, Sue Allen. Yeah, Salmon and I can see. I was in his uh, stream. He he raided out, right? He raided out. I don't know who they are, but we could raid them just for fun. You know, being as uh, we were going to raid on Salmon. And if you've got a suggestion, though, that's who I'll we'll go with. We'll go with that. Uh, don't worry if you can't. It's fine. It's fine. Um, should, we, should we just do a rando? Should we just do a rando raid? I haven't done a random raid for a long time. For a long old time. Um, random raid. Yeah, I'm gonna sit. I'm gonna look who's um, streaming this game. Oh, I'm in the list. That's weird. <laughs> I'm in the list. Um, let's go by numbers. New to this game. Okay. Let's go with Oh, this guy This guy has got pickle in his name. First Fallout game, 100% platinum grind. Platinum achievement, YOLO, chill. Oh, dang. <laughs> right, I'm picking you. You're first in the list. 
and your name is uh, got lemon in it. Uh, yeah, let's go for you. Right, I'm gonna do a little shout out again. Okay, I don't know this person by the way. Um, so uh, you know, if um, I I can't be held responsible for what they're like. I'm sure they're lovely. Okay. But I don't know for sure. This is completely random. Because we haven't done this for a little while. They're playing Fallout 4. And they're at the top of the list. So uh, we're going to pick them. Uh, I'm going to give them a shout out. Hopefully that worked. Did I spell that right? Maybe I didn't spell it right. <laughs> don't worry. I give my best impression. Alright. Let's try that again. I'm not going to lie, the fact that they've got Lemon in their name kind of uh, swayed me as well. Well, that's their name. And uh, copy-paste it. If you get left behind, uh, that's where we're going to go. Is that, why isn't that working? Maybe they don't have any clips? Who knows? Alright, alright. Hopefully the raid will work. Anyway... Hopefully the raid will work, okay? Um, let me type that out. It's kind of a long name, so let me take my time a second. You know what I'm like. Oh, I know what I've done. I've m misspelt it. I put an extra L in there. Let me try and shout them out. God, shambles. Absolute shambles. Maybe it's a good thing we're ending for the night. Still nothing? Might not have clips. Okay. Yeah, that's what I was maybe thinking. Right, hopefully, hopefully the raid works. Uh, there we go, that's fine. Alright, alrighty then. Blimey heck, what a shambles. Sorry about that. But uh, like I said, I don't know who this person is. Never met them before. We're just going to uh, randomly raid on them because they're playing Fallout 4. And uh, they got Lemon in their name, which uh, swayed me as well. Um, so yeah, thank you very much once again for coming to hang out. Um, we're getting there slowly with Fallout 4, okay? And I'll be back next week, and we'll make uh, a little bit more progress uh, towards uh, our goals. Uh, but uh, have a great big Friday, okay? Thanks for coming to hang out with me. Hopefully I'll see you tomorrow for some Mecha Gear Saturdays. But until then, uh, good night. God bless and uh, Nostar. Bye-bye. <laughs>